welcome back to Toy Crush. Today I'm going to open the Amagami. And this is a house and a character inside. And so it says, Custom me, customize me and my house with everything inside. So I've never done one of these before. This is what the back looks like. And so you've got a Scotty dog and a dog house. And then different paper parts and reusable stickers and a curling tool and 12 pens and caps. So it says to open here, so I'm gonna just try it and see how this works, if I can open it here. This is a little bit more difficult than it looks. It looks like you just press through there, but it's really not doing much of that. So let's see if I can get into it somehow else. I might have to tear this packaging. Luckily I have my scissors here to help me. Alright, well that didn't go as well as I thought it would, but we'll just rip through this. So here's some of the paper that's inside. Cool looking. And if we can get this out, we should be good. Alright. All right, so I'm gonna just pull this off of here. So there's the house. And then here is the little Scotty dog. So, so there's the dog with his dog house. And then we've got these curling tools and pens over here. So I'm gonna take that off. I just knocked over the house, goodness me. All right. And I'm going to take these out of their package so that I have them. So here's all these little pens. And on the back of the box, I'm looking to see if there's any kind of real instructions. And I don't see any. I think we just kind of design it and figure it out ourselves. So hopefully I'll be good at this. There's tape on there. I'm just going to cut through it. There we go. Just going to get all the paper out. Okay, so there are some instructions in here. So, on the instructions, it says to punch out the paper parts and strips. And you've got pens with parts fit into the designated holes on the figure and cut the strip before or after you put them on and you can create it any way you want. So let's check it out. So I've got all these paper parts that I can punch out. So I'll punch a couple of them out and show you how it goes. So here's this part. So I guess what I can do if I want to is punch a piece of paper in here. I don't know exactly how it works, but I've got the pens, so if I want to use the pens, I can use them like this, I'm guessing. And I'm not sure I'm doing this exactly right, so maybe I can put it like that on there. I'm not exactly positive I'm doing this right. And then I also have all these cool stickers to put on too. All right, so let's go ahead and punch out one of these. The um, paper is really hard, like cardstock paper. So it's cool because you'll be able to form it. So I've got all these cool designs on here that I can use. So I've got all these cool parts and I'm going to just kind of put stuff on. So I like this little fire hydrant, so I'm going to put it on here and I put a pen through here. So I'm just going to slip that on and it goes right through there. So I can put all of these pens on here that I want and wherever I want to put a pen, I just put it in 
and it'll hold in place and I can put anything I want on there. So maybe I want to put a dog bowl. You can layer stuff. That's what's cool. You can layer stuff. I could put that over top of the fire hydrant, but I don't really want to. Um, I'm gonna pull that off. And I can put things on the actual dog itself. So I could put a pen down inside the dog's head. And then I can put something on that. So I could put like this coming off of it. His head, like that. So how cool is that? All right, I've got a rainbow and paper parts will fit up in these slots too. So I can actually put this rainbow, I know you can't see it, I'll bring it down here. I can actually put it in here. So I've got all these parts that'll fit up here on top of the house too. So there's a weather vane and it's got a little Scotty dog on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that weather vane on here like this. Well, maybe I'll put it like that. So it's showing which way the wind's blowing. And mine's bent a little probably because of how I punched it out, but that's okay. And I can just keep designing and I can do whatever I want and make this however I want it to be. So I love that about it. I love that it's so cool that you can design it yourself. So I'm just adding little parts to put on and I'm going to like this side better. So I'm putting this on my Scotty dog and I'm gonna add another pen and put this one on and his head will move. I probably should have put that the other way. So the pens are all different. You've got different types of pens for different things and you just put it on however you want to. So I'm just designing that Scotty dog. So these are really cool. Um, I'm gonna actually move this one and use it as his tail. So how cool is that? So you design these any way that you want. And you can also put stickers on. So if I want to take a sticker, I'm gonna take this bow tie one and take this sticker I can put it on the actual Scotty dog. I'll turn that around and I'm gonna put it right under here like this. So he's got this little bow tie or this little tie on. How cute is that? So I really like this. This allows you to be as creative as you want to be and you can design things the way that you want and it's totally unique to how you decide to design it. So hopefully you liked this video. If you did, hit the like button and comment below what videos you'd like to see in the future and show us your Amagami creations. Thanks for watching.